friend who is a he's a retired by the good friend of him. He goes fishing every day. He catches a limit of 25 perch every day. 25? Oh, yeah. Oh, the limit. Okay. Like, Welcome back, Snoop Troop. Y'all, today, I'm outside, actually, as you can see, because it was a beautiful day, and I wanted to uh, just enjoy the weather. I hope the uh, sound is all right, but if not, I'll learn next time. But Arby's has this, uh, this Wagyu burger, and I heard a lot about it, so I wanted to give it a try. It looks delicious. Hold on. Let me get my setup out here, and I hope I hope no bugs come out here harassing me, or no. No animals come out here bothering me. You know I got the curlies, and I, hold on, let me take my hat off. Let me do a, a thummy. Go ahead and get a prayer, prayer. Thank you, Lord, for this food I'm about to receive. Amen. All right, let's go for the, uh, let's go for the goods. I haven't done a mukbang in a while. Well, this Loki look good, and they make these uh, medium, I think medium or medium well. So we'll see. It's got tomatoes, pickles, lettuce. It's the deluxe. They got a, like a bacon ranch burger. Uh -huh. Sauce really complements the burgers and mm. I don't know if I don't know if you can make a hamburgers medium well. Well I used to see all the memes talking about who's keeping Arby's in business. This definitely will. Mm. Hmm. Let me try another bite. Got some pink in there, which I don't know how I feel about that. So I'll do that with a steak all day, but a burger, they grind up the meat, so it's not the same. So that's a little off-putting to me, but they know what they're doing. And if I get sick, I'm coming up a check. <laughs> Mm. And then if you know if you go to Arby's You gotta get the curly fries There's one thing I I just do not understand about this world It's bugs Like look they don't even be worried about the food. Hmm. They come over here. We are in all of outside. There's a lot of outside around here. Whole wide world of outside. And you come to land on me? Why are you bothering me buzzing in my ear? Now I gotta, now something gotta happen. But no, 
I think it's like, I was talking to somebody yesterday now, my like, summer's around the corner. I'm like, no, it's already summer. Not here, it's not. It was just like 40 or 50 yesterday. <coughs> Today, I don't even know what the weather is. I don't know if y'all can see this. I had a another weekend of bouncing. Oh, I think that's not the right job for me. So even though it's just like a one day thing, like maybe a Friday or a Saturday. I don't like it no more. <coughs> People get to drinking and talking too crazy and I'm a changed man. Amber. We got some exciting news on the way. Some I'm not going to speak on yet. And others. I got another comedy show tonight. I've done six shows by now. And uh, the last show that I did, One of the guys who hosts the show out in, cause I'm, I'm in Appleton right now. And um, there's a guy who hosts the show out in Milwaukee. He hosts in Milwaukee and Green Bay. And he was talking to me about potentially hosting a show. And I know you're supposed to fake it till you make it. But I was like, Super wishy-washy. I'm going to perform again tonight. Because I only have like maybe five minutes. Because that's all the sets that they give you when you're new. Well, if you're talking about giving me 15 to 20 minutes, I got to come correct. But then I'm also getting paid. Anywhere from 500 to 1,000. So that'll be exciting. I mean, it's a whole new stream of income just by being funny. I'll take it. That's actually probably one of the most exciting things, especially with doing YouTube because without <laughs> without doing YouTube, I don't think um, I'd be able to like not have that fear when it came to uh, getting on the stage. I'm laughing because you ever have a um, a gaggle of uh, fruit flies just harass you, and, like surround your head, and I see them all over here looking at this juicy, delicious Arby's burger. Let me take a second to show y'all the view. We got the water. It's a real nice. Let me set this back down. It's real nice out here. I don't even know how well that showed up, but um And I don't know how well my sound is gonna be, but uh, I'm enjoying this. This would be perfect, like, if I did a collab with somebody out here. You got people going fishing. Um, I think it's too early for flies to come out, so that's weird, because I don't mind. Y'all might, some of y'all might think this is hectic, but a fruit fly? All right, you know, I can pick off the piece, throw it. I don't think these are fruit flies, though. I think these are gnats, but a fruit fly or a gnat lands on my food, I'll just pick off the piece. You know, those don't bother me. But a house fly?
And I was talking to some people and I watch, um, there's this woman I watch on YouTube and then I, I can't remember her name, so sorry, but she's big, so she ain't stunned me. And then also the best ever food show and he be in like other countries and they just let flies land on their stuff. I'm like, man, if I want to travel overseas or go overseas, that is something I'm really going to have to get over. Y'all let me know, because I can't go for that. The, and I think for me, the only thing is, hey, I got this new Arby's burger. It's the Wagyu burger. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's the talk of the town. You guys want to say hi? I agree with you. Sometimes fast, you can't beat fast food sometimes, right? What is it? What is I'm it? filming from my YouTube channel. You guys can say oh. hi. Okay. No, no, no. You can, say, you can say hi. No. <laughs> sometimes you can't beat fast food. And so, but we, we, we ate lunch and then we had to get the minerals. So oh, yeah. Had, well, called Fleet Farm. Right there was Fleet Farm from Apple and Fleet Farm was right on the way. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, I had to call Fleet. Do you have minerals? Yeah, we do. And at the gas station. Mm -hmm. There are not too many places you can get them. And then I said, then, of course, I think that BP and Manasha does. I said, BP she and said, Manasha. do you want to sit in the car? She said, no, I'll sit in the car as well. You can sit in the car or you can check and pick up your ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you think she did? She <laughs> came out. Uh -huh. Right? Yes, I did. Did you have ice cream today? No, no, no. Well, you and better you get listen, going <laughs> after you. <laughs> I, don't know, I, I, mean, I understand this, but I don't understand not having ice cream. <laughs> you guys, what is your name, sir? Levante. Levante. Yeah. Oh, nice to meet you, Levante. This oh. is Jim and this is Jules. Nice, Jim, and nice to meet you. Do you guys keep the fish or you let them go? Oh, yeah. But the cat, did you catch perch out here? Okay. Yeah. Have you, have you, are you from here? Yeah, I grew up in Nina. Oh, where do you mm. live now? In Appleton. Oh. <laughs> Oh, the limit. Okay. It doesn't take very long either. Now, when Google start biting on the other side of this wall, mm -hmm. he goes, I asked him, his wife, his wife, she, we go to church every day in the morning mm -hmm. at the Catholic church. She goes, she's there in the morning too. She says, he's not there. I said, what time is he? Does he go fishing? Yeah. What time does he get up in the morning? Four. And he came back at seven. Four is a little early. He, 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 yeah, well, I do too. <laughs> anyway, he, but you know, he, but he, what time do you get up to? And then he came right at seven. He has a food limit of 25 with you. 25? So, oh. right, that's it. He gets, his, he gets there by by five or something from Divine Rock or whatever. He gets home by seven. Two hours of fishing. He's got his meal. They're spawning right now on their side. Oh, are they? Just spawning, fighting on, on swarms. I've always wanted to do a catch clean cook for my YouTube channel. <laughs> I, used, I like love watching those videos. Like they catch the fish, they yeah. cook, clean them, and then they cook them, and then they. Yeah eat them on the channel so how long have you been doing this Levante? for my own channel about a year almost a year now you like what you're doing yeah i love doing youtube okay. all my subs are the nicest um they're really sweet and um yeah. your responses overviews you know yeah. reviews are very good yeah my views are they're pretty good i have almost 12k subs and i probably get anywhere from like four thousand to Ten. Your messages are beautiful. I yeah, for like, for the most part, ninety percent. Yeah, but you know, there's good. those people out there. I think so too. <laughs> I think so too. Uh, you have yeah. a plus there, you know. You too. Yeah. Yeah. Well, take care. We okay. Care. All right, guys. Nice meeting you, Levante. Nice to meet you Enjoy too. Enjoy your what you're doing. <laughs> for sure. Yeah. That's the Midwest for you guys. I think the South has very nice hospitality too. But you know, <laughs> that should be my intro, huh? I said four to ten. Only good. I think my highest video, I don't know. I ain't gotta get into that. But I think I'm the happiest when. 
either I'm filming with somebody else or I'm doing a vlog. Even if the even if there's a, a mukbang in the vlog, but like today I'm starving. It's almost kind of hard to talk to yourself. But if I take like more days in between my mukbangs, I have more to talk about. So that's basically like my logic on it now, unless I'm filming with somebody else. So I don't think I post in a while. I've had a lot going on, a lot of shows. Um, meeting new people. I've met tons of people in the comedy world. I've gotten a lot of feedback, even from you guys on here. I got people wanting to do skits. Let me know if y'all... <sighs> I have a like a, a dilemma with the skits, but not really, but it's kind of like... I want to go about it correctly, because some things are... Even if it's funny, I feel like it's it's too childish for me. Like if, if I'm if I would actually enjoy watching it. But at the end of the day, funny is funny, and uh, you really become like uh, proud of your work. I think that's one of the biggest things: becoming proud of your work and like what you put out and the effort you put into it. But I love doing collabs with people when it comes to mukbangs. And I've said this before, is because we grew up having like family dinner together. So it's almost like nostalgic in a way. But yeah, I'm thinking about what I, what I, what I wanna do for my year anniversary. Um, Oh, I did a video with Letitia Campbell on her channel. So go check it out. Shout out Letitia Campbell. Um, and we were talking about um, dang, I forgot. That's lost my train of thought. Anyway. It'll come, it'll come back. Something we was talking about in that video. Somebody remind me. I don't know. It's a beautiful day out here, though. It is beautiful. Um, I think the video, uh, I think it was something like along the, the videos you enjoy doing more um, and not getting the same response. But at the end of the day, you know, I'm still very grateful. It's, oh, all right, so that's what we're talking about. I feel like I got ADD sometimes. I'll be all over the place. Um, I've had my YouTube channel for 10 years because I used to post videos when I was in high school and college and It's just like all basketball stuff and I didn't really post since then So when I say I've been doing YouTube for about a year that doesn't include Dalvin's channel like my first Intro video I think is in like July or June Late June early July Late June so I got my year anniversary of I guess all you guys knowing me and uh, I'm really trying to think of you know what what should I do it's been a long journey I got I'm happy with the amount of subscribers I have I'm happy with the feedback I get and the people that um, rock with me I wish y'all follow me on Instagram though at Ellie Carson that is L-E-C-A-R-S-O-N Um, so if you're watching this up to this part, go follow me on Instagram, all my socials, but no, yeah, it's been a, it's been a journey and there's a lot, there's a lot of exciting stuff coming out. I know we say that I probably said that a lot, but no, yeah, I feel like I've kept true to my word. There's some things I haven't done just cause of logistics and stuff, but I'm excited. There's a lot of things going on and. I want to do something big for my year anniversary. Y'all let me know. Maybe a giveaway, maybe a raffle, maybe a... Hmm. What should it be? I, I feel like those are the best two options, a giveaway or a raffle. But yeah. Yeah, I think those two are nice. I'm glad I came out here. I low-key want to sit out here all, all day. 
and just chill. I might actually go take a nap on the ground or something. Nah, them bugs be bothering me and stuff. <laughs> but um, let's get back to this burger. Um, I'm gonna give this a nine. Y'all, if you don't mess with Arby's or you think Arby's is trash, check out this burger. This is going to change your mind on Arby's forever. Ooh, is that a title? This burger will, for, this burger will forever change your mind about Arby's. Yeah. I like it. Shout out to uh, the lovely couple that came and talked to me about Blue Gills and Perch. Hope you guys watch this. Maybe you guys can take me fishing. Maybe I should go. Should I go fishing with them, y'all? Should, should I do a vlog and just go kick it with them? Nah, I don't want to ruin their family daytime. Or else I would. So I really enjoyed this burger. I really enjoyed this time. And I really enjoyed this nature. I hope the sound is not too crazy. The cars are pretty far back. I hear the birds chirping pretty crazy. So hopefully it's not too crazy. And you know what? I didn't even check how much memory I have. <laughs> so make sure y'all follow me on all my socials. Ellie Carson. That's L-E-C-R-S-O-N. Um... Yeah, thanks for thanks for tuning in, guys. Snoop TV is out. Oh, keep my shit been going. Oh, see, no, you are not my bro. Please quit acting like you know me.